We realize in our society that literacy and math and reading and writing are competencies. And we have to view peace literacy as a competency that is even more complex than our, our than literacy and math and reading and writing. And just to show how much this paradigm has to change, I, I'd have teachers say, well, what we want to do, we want to get all the ninth through 12th graders into an auditorium and you can do a 30 minute thing about peace. And I'll say, we don't teach any other subject in school that way. There is no other subject in school. We don't get the ninth through 12th graders together in an auditorium and do a 30 minute math lesson, right? Four different age, four different age groups all together in an auditorium, hundreds of kids in K through 12. We don't teach any other subject that way. So why would we teach peace? And keep in mind, peace involves how to deal with trauma, how to resolve conflict, how to navigate technology. I mean, these are things that people could use every day and could benefit families, workplaces, nations, communities. But we live in a society where people aren't taught the most basic peace skills. We don't teach people how to heal rage, alienation, how to find fulfilling sources of purpose and meaning, belonging, self-worth, expression. And not only are we not teaching people that, we're often teaching them the opposite, right? At least we're not teaching people the opposite of mathematics. And so this is one reason why I have so much realistic hope is I'm surprised humans aren't more violent when you consider that we're not taught these things and we're so often taught the opposite. And there's so much conditioning that would make people want to be violent. I'm actually surprised that violence isn't far more common. And so I think that if we were to take peace as seriously as we take math or reading and writing, if we took peace as seriously as people took basketball, the world would be dramatically different, at least in terms of giving people tools to constructively solve problems in ways that produce more peace and justice.